he is an entrepreneur he is an innovator he is an angel investor and he is an industry leader he is the bishma pitama of indian it industry he is an entrepreneur technology leader and innovator with an illustrious career spanning across private public sectors he is passionate about improving the lives of indian youth through technology education and employment opportunities that we all are cherishing the fruits of we we'll li- like you to speak something about soil and also about the educational reforms for the coming generations thank you thank you sir good morning to all of you at the outset i would like to congratulate uh, the entire soil team for really demonstrating a wonderful products in the last country and uh, all the robots bots <clears throat> really demonstrated what technology can do the, with the help of small kids congratulations uh, particularly srikant usha anju sachcha and the entire team of soil in fact today i wanted to give my soil experience <clears throat> I don't have digital soil experience but I have actual soil experience. Last 3 years during this pandemic my mother was sick so I decided to stay more time with my mother in my village. When I went to my village in Anantapur I have uh, 500 acres of organic uh, farming. Of course earlier I was doing the phone agriculture from Hyderabad I used to call my brother hey what's happening <coughs> what about and kind the of fertilizers uh, used and all that that phone agriculture was happening nothing was coming only one way from hyderabad i used to send money that's it but when i went there <coughs> first of all i could see i could dirty my hands going to the uh, my 500 acres farm and talking to the not only the workers and also talking to the plants i get uh, i i i that time i knew that what i was missing in agriculture so in agriculture absent agriculture that's what happens so i think that formula applies everywhere the why soil is a digital experiential learning you are giving earlier uh, my agriculture there is no experiential learning only in uh, talking to somebody and uh, whether they are going, going there talking to the plants seeing that uh, something is happening that was not happening so i could see the difference physically i am available there for my agriculture and uh, managing the farm and at least uh, i could bring a change what they were doing earlier now what is uh, happening in my agriculture in that i also noticed when i went there to my farm one day the farm workers were cutting down all the uh, uh, plant branches and all that which uh, was bearing some fruits i asked them why are you cutting those uh, branches which has got some fruits no sir the pruning is very much required unless you cut the unnecessary branches the plant cannot grow i think the if you apply the same principle the small kid is there and if he is looking at various other uh, uh, things and if you properly groom him mentor him prune him see that he grows well i think uh, the same uh, looking at the nature i mean i was applying what is that you can learn from the nature how you can apply in the digital soil though i still not uh, fully into digital soil but uh, actually uh, into the physical soil that's one the second thing when i was there uh, ajit garu i was running a small gurukul for my uh, farm workers uh, children there are a lot of farm workers used to uh, be in the same campus anyway uh, <clears throat> i have a lot of time every day early morning i used to take them for walk and uh, tell them about mahabharat ramayana they knew nothing about any of those things then i used to conduct some quizzes in the evening times and uh, afterwards they started learning about ramayana mahabharata and all that this thing during that time uh, one day srikanth called me sir uh, we have started a uh, hey, journal artificial intelligence journal uh, they requested me to inaugurate that's when i started knowing about what soil and soil team is doing then i introduced uh, one of my farm workers daughters arshita she was in 9th uh, grade arshita you were in 9th grade that time 10th okay she is here <clears throat> so when i introduced her why didn't you 
you people mentor her from that day i have seen the transformation though she is from the village for my farm worker's daughter and now she got admission in cornell university with a full scholarship so that is the outcome if only we guide the people wherever they are whether they are in the rural area rural area or urban area doesn't matter what is required i have seen in fact uh, my both grandkids are here their energy levels are different and their the way they are acquiring the knowledge is different i was uh, just talking to ajit and uh, bala subramaniam that when we were studying whatever teachers has to say that's it whatever is there in the book that's it beyond that there is no other way today nothing everything is there in google ekalavya education only thing is we have to guide them most of the parents today particularly in the urban areas they are all quite busy they throw some guy gadgets to their kids okay take this and uh, they are busy in their own so if you do that what happens the same technology can divert them to the wrong sides and uh, the same energy levels can go into the wrong direction that's a disaster for the country for the globe that's where the mentorship is required that's where companies like soil should uh, enable those kids where there is no proper mentoring and all that whatever they are doing in the soil i i notice that uh, digitally they are connecting all of them and giving them some projects making them interested uh, in learning those things today when they are able to uh, becoming expert by the time they come to the uh, 10th year in uh, programming like python and uh, they are using uh, raspberry pi and all that so i think uh, my assessment is uh, these kids if they are properly trained they will not go beyond 10th class by the time they come to the 10th class they will start a company i am i already decided that i want to invest in my first grandson's uh, company before he goes to the 10th class because that's how i'm seeing uh, the way he is acquiring the knowledge and all that because uh, earlier gurukul education where were the certificates where were the degrees whether it is emperor's son or sipahi's son they used to go to forest and they whatever guru says i mean they used to learn all those things no certificates were there right? today iit certificate phd stanford and all that the i think that certificates and phds paper these things all over the gurukul education ekalavya education is coming back that's where i think the contribution from uh, uh, people like uh, soil uh, more startups uh, should come forward and uh, enable this ecosystem so that uh, more children can be guided properly the more harshita kind of examples you should create why only one harshita should uh, should get into uh, that kind of uh, this thing you should create more Harsh- harshitas across the uh, country maybe across the globe with this i once again uh, congratulate uh, the entire soil team for uh, really demonstrating your capabilities wish you all the best